Hi everybody, Neil Malik from Knack Training bringing you another everyday office video. And in today's video, I want to demonstrate how you can apply the exact same headers and footers to basically every PDF you have. So you could create your headers and footers in Microsoft Word, but specifically for something like page numbering, for example. If you modify the number of pages while you're in Adobe Acrobat, that page numbering that you built in Microsoft Word will not update to that. So sometimes it's a good idea to do the page numbering or other types of uh, additional content in Acrobat. I happen to be using Acrobat DC, the, the latest version of Acrobat here, um, but this basically holds true in all the different versions of Adobe Acrobat. So over here on the right, you'll see my Edit PDF button. Click on Edit PDF. So now I'm modifying the sales document. Notice I have a second tab here for my marketing document, so that's where we'll apply these changes afterward. And of course, I wanna do a header or a footer, so I go to header and footer over on the right and click on Add. So I happen to know that in these documents, uh, my standard font is Amesis font. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose Amesis. There we go. So I've got my Amesis font, and uh, let's go down here to center footer text. Now I wanna add a page number here, but let's take a quick little tangent over here to the right to the page number and date format. And I'll say that my page numbering format should say like page one of the number of pages we've got. Click OK and then I can click on the centered footer text and click on insert page number. So there it is, page one of 13 in Amesis 10 point font. And I think to myself, you know what? This works. And I would probably like to apply this to a bunch of PDFs moving forward. So up at the top, you can see that my settings haven't been uh, saved right now, but I can click here on save settings on the right. I can call this something like um, marketing, document page numbering or something along those lines then click OK and I can apply it to this by clicking OK but then here's where the real magic happens so first of all all these pages now have page 4 of 13 or whatever we're, we've got going on but then on top of that here with the marketing document you can see here there's no page numbering on it so I click on edit PDF over here on the right I choose header and footer up at the top of the screen add a header or footer, and then right here on the drop-down menu for saved settings, I say, oh, let's go ahead and apply the marketing document page numbering, and you can see that automatically applies it. So this is a 12-page document, and it says page one of 12 in Amesis 10-point font. And when I click OK, that page numbering gets applied to this new document, and this will happen across uh, Adobe Acrobat for as long as I've got those saved settings.